Hello everyone, and welcome to Drake Makes. It is crunch time. I began the process of environment design in the ever unstable Unreal Engine 5, but first started off with one more Procreate sketch to help get my mind wrapped around the ideas I wanted to move forward with. With the sketch prepared, I also searched Google for some reference images. Specifically, I was most inspired by architecture of the World Fairs from St. Louis in 1904 and Chicago in 1893. These incredible events perfectly encapsulate the clash of the modern electrical era and the utopian vision of ancient cultures. With my vision in mind, I went in search of assets. I utilized the Industrial Mega Pack, Good Sky, Water Planes, and Dungeon Lamps Pack from the Epic Games Store and a ton of the Mega Scans, proceeding to lay the pieces out like Lego bricks in my scene. Having assets laid out like this helped me understand what I'm working with and got me focused on how I specifically wanted to go on with the environmental and architectural design. As assets downloaded, I began laying some framework. For the water, I have three separate ocean planes set up, with the farther planes ever so slightly tilted upwards so that the water sits better in the frame, visually cheating it a little bit. As for the landscape, I busted out the Nordic Mountains, also from Megascans, and began experimenting with how I wanted to frame the scene. We want to sell the movement, so it's important to have the environment go back in layers. This gives that good sense of parallax. With the mountains and islands in a decent position, I started hand-placing a great web of telephone wires. I did some forcing of perspective through scaling and rotating of the poles. These telephone wires are important compositional elements that are going to both sell the movement and guide the eye towards the focal point. Starting to get cross-eyed from all the wires, I started attempting to make a coliseum. This looked bad, so I went on to Sketchfab and downloaded Hal Halhanov's 3D model off of Sketchfab. Nailed it. The model was absolutely perfect. I applied a Megascans texture with very little care, as with the Colosseum being so far away, you don't notice the crummy textures. I then experimented with the lighting of the arches of the Colosseum, which I feel looked pretty cool. After that, more wires. And more wires. Days of stringing up wires. There was definitely a more efficient way to do this, Pros are likely screaming at their screens, but I started to find something meditative about hand-placing all the assets. Thoroughly brain-dead from the repetition, I moved on to exporting the floating cube. But then I thought, wouldn't it be cooler to have a giant statue in the middle? Yes. So to Mixamo I went and decided on this meditation pose. And sure enough, this looked pretty neat.
messed with the statue's textures for a while, trying out a few substance paint or paint jobs before deciding on the Unreal Engine starter content stone material. Sometimes, you don't gotta be fancy. After this, I started filling out the distant architectural backdrop. My original vision for the piece had more of this in mind, but with it being so far in the distance, I feel much more detail would start muddying the scene with too much noise. Because of this, I kept the buildings extremely simple and unfinished, just enough to pass from a distance. Around this point, I was growing pretty satisfied. And I'm gonna call it there. I've got around five days to add the finishing exterior touches and design an interior. I've had a ton of fun thus far, and I really like the direction we're headed in, so let's now just run it home. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check out my Infinite Journeys playlist to see my entire process.